Hi guys, so today I'm going to be cleaning out my hamster. I've got two, which is I'm only doing one today because I did the other one yesterday. But I forgot to film it because I was too busy. And then later on I'm going to be doing another video of me doing my wardrobe. So that'll be good one. And um, yes, yeah, so to get a bag. And then my little tip is to put it like that. Um, Put it like this, and I'm just having it a bit more forward, and then put it into that. And then... Oops. Oops. Put it right in the sun. And then we give it like, a little bit of a wash, because it's a bit dirty. So... We should put the back on the chair because we start to bite through this bag and it's kind of bad. I'm only doing one for that one. Yeah. Um, uh, hello. Yeah. I did a house in New York City. What's this for us in here? I think because it's always a little dirty. It's not like cuffing. Now I've got a Syrian hamster and a Dewar hamster, so that's pretty good. Um, and they're both really handsome. They don't bite. None of them do. I mean, would never bite or hurt a little soul. Um, oh, it's really mighty. It's really bad today. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, I kind of have to, I have to half the block and then all these like bits that are actually together I just crumble them up so I just keep crumbling and put it all down now if you guys have a hamster and you're not very good at cleaning them out and and you only do, or you just and you got hamster and I will give you some tips now guys for that. And so how does actually um usually only you need their wee wee spot clean now um once a month or you clean clean them out fully once a month and then clean their pee spots out every week. Um 
I don't know why that is. If you want to know, I just when I got my hamsters, they told me to do that. Um, so that's very good. Now this is related to food. So if you want to get a dwarf hamster, they only have food like as much food as the size of a penny. So yeah, a penny or a pound, whichever one you wanna say. Or if you've read somewhere else that it says a pound, that's fine. Or yeah, I usually tend to give my dwarf hamster a little bit more because he likes to eat quite a lot. Um, same with my Syrian hamster. Syrian hamsters also just when they, they just eat quite a lot. So yeah, my Syrian hamster has two um two uh bowls because he literally otherwise is really grumpy if he doesn't. Um yeah, so and he always, both my hamsters are always very gentle. They don't bite. They don't want to hurt anybody. All they want to do is just have some fun in their life. So, yeah. And if you're going to wonder what I will get um, as a pet when these two are sleep back and forth, um, I'll probably ask to get um, either a fish or another hamster. I would say another hamster because fishes you can't really do much with fish you can't but fish you can't really do much with so that's why i would go with a uh, hamster um yeah and also tonight i'm going to be doing another video of me um doing making some lasagna with my mum so my mum's gonna be in that video first time um she's gonna be a bit cringe <laughs> sorry if my video is a bit cringy um yeah so that you know um sorry if this video is like <sighs> all the time i'm really 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 sorry um i don't know why it does it on my phone it just the signs have a funny few seconds or minutes so yeah i will try and sort that out for you guys but i think it's to do like i i don't know how it happens on everybody's thing but um on my phone it shows whistling sound and I must have it on full volume so I'll sort that out so I do this to see if you get any lumps out which I just found a few lumps Like, uh, excuse me. I will show you my hamster. Now I'm just gonna get a bit more because I can't enjoy it. My guess. Underestimated. And then, um, if you ever have any issues with my video you can come out and just say maybe you can improve on this and stuff like that right i'm going to give you a few more tips on hamsters so hamsters usually like to well i get my hamsters out for that three times a week because um they need a lot of time to be out and it's not fair if you just keep them in their cages so i do use to let my hamsters get out and about um, around the house and that, so then they have some, like, time and that, to just do whatever they want really, and I have to do two checks and everything after, to make sure everything's cleaned up, oh, my little sister's probably going to pick up the food, and then she's probably going to think it's food, so, we don't want that, because <laughs> my sister's going to be as well, so I'm just breaking it up a little bit more. Now it's time to pack it all 
down. So I usually do little pictures with all this food, so I'm probably gonna do that again today. Um it's all on the knife mine. Sometimes I give them um, some like biscuits and I'm not trying. Um, I still wonder why I'm putting in now it's desert sand because that's where they like to um, weed. Now I kind of get a bit all over as well. But then we're not. Um, so today I'm going to do sunshine because I did that with my steering wheel. Um, feeding stick and a bit of stuff. Lovely. So I get the feeding stick out. I don't usually get feeding sticks because obviously it's not like what I do, it's just to help with when they gnaw in there because otherwise they're going to gnaw all the time to me. It's quite frustrating for me when I'm cleaning them out because then I find that they've been literally peeing in my bathroom. And also, they just like might to gnaw basically. So, okay. So, I use a bit of this. Now, they both have um, houses that I stuff with um, stuff. So, yeah. And they're quite picky how they like their things. They like it very organised. My hamster is just really organised, probably because quite organised. Um, so I'm gonna go and get uh Twizzy's house. Um it's the one I'm cleaning out now, Twizzy. My running the wall for Twizzy. My area is called Muffin. Because Muffin looks like a muffin. And um, I have no idea where my house right now. I think it's probably Muffin's house. So, I also tip every I also tip everything out of their house as well. So, um, when the house is nice and clean, I'm not the house is just stink. I don't really want that for my hamster. I don't clean out the house though because they each just have like a nice, really smell them for them because they also have certain smells and. That jazz. Um, so, just got a bit. So, just fill that. Um, now it's time. Well, so I start to clean up at this point. And yeah, I know they've got wheels and all that. My funny fact is I haven't actually wheels. Um, on the subject. My Syrian doesn't have a wheel because he um, doesn't use them. So if you look in his cage, so if, if you ever see his cage, that's why I'm not like about it. I don't like him. It's just he doesn't use a wheel. I don't know why. He's just not always into wheels and that. So he won't tend to use it that much. Um, but he never uses it. So, I'll go there and put this stuff away. Now, these are both my hamsters. Um, and I have to tidy up when I have to do those because I have no one to kill them in. So, you know, I don't want to happen to those are very nice um, honey. So, yeah. So, we're going to just...
the wheel. Can't do these sometimes in the wheel? But I can't tell. So I'm just gonna move this bit dirty. So it does give it a little squeal.